And now, marine weather around Alaska. Starting off the marine segment with a look at tonight's weather. Again, we've got this uh, low here dropping southward now across the Alaska Peninsula, bringing some pretty gusty northwest winds anywhere from 40 to 50, maybe even 55 miles an hour here to the eastern Aleutians and uh, with uh, rain into the western Alaska Peninsula and then improving back to the north here. Winds starting to come down over the northern Bering Sea, St. Lawrence Island into the Bering Strait. And then this uh, new storm actually pulling northeastward here, bringing uh, increase in the wind and rain to Kodiak Island with rain all the way up here, merging into the moisture. It's already up along the North Gulf Coast and uh, drying out over the Southeast Coast until that moves in late tonight and tomorrow. More rain for the Panhandle with increasing winds as uh, another low tracks north, northwestward off the north coast there. That could kick the winds up, uh, especially on the north coast with rain all the way down to the Queen Charlotte Islands, dry in the interior. Chance of uh, light snow or flurries along the central western Arctic coast extending down into the Bering Strait. Showers and breezy here over the southeast Bering Sea, western eastern Aleutians into the Alaska Peninsula. And then for the day on Monday, still a chance of snow up here, light snow or flurries, western Arctic coast to the north side of the Seward Peninsula. Another uh, cold front now pushing into the far northwestern Bering Sea there, otherwise high pressure, light winds and dry conditions for all of the Aleutians, still a risk of a shower early on there for the eastern Aleutians, but winds coming down here along the southwest coast, still pretty breezy for the Alaska Peninsula, scattered showers, drier over south central Alaska, but still showery and unsettled for the North Gulf Coast, Prince William Sound, in across the southeast coast with this low here over the southern Gulf of Alaska, continuing to pull moisture northward there. And that's just uh, spilling into the panhandle up to about Yakutat westward into Prince William Sound. Coastal water forecast, we've got gale warnings on the south coast tomorrow, southeast at 35 knots, east winds 30 to 35 knots on the central coast, north coast east 25 to 30 knots. And for uh, Clarence Strait and Stevens Passage, southeast winds 25 knots with higher gusts and south at 20 for Lynn Canal. Outlook for Monday, lighter winds here all areas with uh, south, to south, or south winds at 20 knots on the south coast. Otherwise, the uh, central north coast southeast winds around 20 knots with southeast winds at 15 for Stevens Passage and Lynn Canal south at 15 for Clarence Strait. North Gulf Coast tomorrow on the east side, east winds 35 knots, seas 12 feet. Prince William Sound pretty breezy there tomorrow with east winds at 30 knots and seven foot seas. East at 30 also for the western North Gulf Coast. We've got uh, gale warnings out for Southern Cook Inlet. Kamishak Bay and the Barren Islands for northeast winds 35 to 40 knots and small craft advisories for Northern Cook Inlet where winds will be at about 25 knots. And then for the day on Monday, Cook Inlet, north winds 15 knots, seas four feet. Small craft advisories, Kamishak Bay, Barren Islands here, northwest at 25, north at 20 for the western North Gulf Coast. And for the east side there, Middleton Island, Area east winds 25 knots, northeast at 20 for Prince William Sound. Kodiak Island, northeast winds 25 to 30 knots for Sunday. Alaska Peninsula, north to northwest winds 20 to 30 knots and northeast to 20 in the forecast for Bristol Bay. Outlook for Monday, northwest winds 25 to 30 knots for the Alaska Peninsula. Bristol Bay, northwest at 25 knots and Kodiak Island, north to northwest winds 20 to 25 knots, which sees four to nine feet. Eastern Aleutians tomorrow, gale warnings, northwest winds, 35 knots, seas eight to 15 feet, northwest at 30 knots with seven to 12 foot seas for Adak and Atka. Lighter winds out west from the north and northwest at 20 or 15 to 25 knots. And then for the day Monday, western Aleutians, south to southeast winds at 15 to 25 knots. Adak and Atka, west winds at 20 knots or less, with uh, the eastern Aleutians looking at northwest winds, 25 to 30 knots. And for the southwest coast tomorrow, as well as St. Lawrence Island, all looking at northerly winds at 20 knots, about 15 knots for Norton Sound, north 30 knots from St. Matthew Island and the Pribilos with seas up to 13 feet. And the outlook for Monday, 
For the southwest coast, St. Lawrence Island, northwest winds at 30 knots and about 20 knots for Norton Sound with 5-foot seas there. Northwest 25 for the Permloff, seas 11 feet and southwest 25 for St. Matthew Island with seas at 11 feet. For the uh, central and eastern Arctic coast, variable winds at about 10 knots for the day Sunday with seas running around 4 feet. North at 10 for the western Arctic coast, otherwise a Chuck CC. North winds 20 to 30 knots. And then for the day on Monday, Chuck CC, northwest winds 25 to 30 knots with seas running 6 to 8 feet here. And for the uh, western Arctic coast, north winds 15 knots. Northeast at uh, 10 knots here for the central coast. Otherwise, on the eastern Boulevard Sea coast, winds will be out of the west and southwest at around 10 to 15 knots.